Dieses Video wird euch präsentiert von dem Asus Nova Go, dem weltweit ersten Gigabit LTE Notebook mit Snapdragon 835 und einer Akkulaufzeit von bis zu 22 Stunden. Weitere Details in der Infokarte. Hi, mein Name ist Ezra und ich bin Fleer und ich bin heute hier, um über das Cat S61 zu sprechen. Das ist eine zweite Generation Cat Phone. Wie ihr seht, hat es einen embedded Thermal Imager. Der Thermal Imager ist hier und es wird von Fleer gemacht. Ich werde den Thermal Imager durchgehen und euch ein paar weitere neue Features zeigen. Hallo, ich bin Ezra und ich bin Fleer. So if you see the thermal imager here, you can say, you can see that you've got temperature reading. That's standard in every model. The new, ver the new S61 has an extended temperature range. So the predecessor could go from negative 20 to 120, and now you can go from negative 20 to 400 C. So you have quite an additional range of temperatures that you can take, you can get resolution on. In addition to that, we've got what we call reach back, and you can do this through Facebook Live. So you can basically stream what you're looking at through the, on the phone to someone that's back reviewing your data or looking at what and wants to see what you're seeing. In addition, the new app has tips and trick videos that are embedded in the app as well as community feed. So when you take images and you want to share them with other professionals and other users, you can do so through the community. And like you can see, it's got MSX. MSX is what's giving you that detail. It's letting you see the lettering. It's letting you see the edges. It's taking the visible image and embossing those edges onto the thermal image. So if I take that picture, open it. Oops, uh, there you go. Uh, you can see the visible image is behind it. Okay, that's the thermal imager. The thing that's exciting about the S61 is that there are other sensors on the sen device as well. Here you can see you've got a measurement tool and an air sensor, air quality sensor. This, let's take a look at the measurement tool. So the measurement tool, can you see that red laser beam, that laser dot? I can take that picture and it tells me it's 142, 147.2 centimeters to that dot. That can measure up to 10 meters and has accuracy of plus or minus one to two percent. So, in addition to that measurement, uh, the distance meter, there's a VOC sensor. So this is measuring volatile organics in, in parts per billion. The sensor is located on the side of the phone. Let's take a look at it. So you can see I get a, at this, at this view I get a snapshot of what's going on. I can also scroll over and see temperature, humidity, and parts per billion of total uh, volatile organic compounds. You can see here that because we've got flames and candles burning nearby, warming the food, we have a high level of volatile organics in the air right now. Actually, it's an unhealthy level of volatile organics in the air. This is a good indicator that at this point, maybe we need some fresh air. So the extended temperature range in the, in the thermal camera, the Facebook live streaming, the new additions to the app are all new to the thermal imaging MyFlare application. The addition of the measurement tool using a laser and the air quality sensor for measuring volatile organics are both new additions to the CAT S61 this year. The CAT Phone S61 will be available and shipping at the end of the second quarter of 2018.